Hello, hello guys. Welcome back to my channel, The Red Pack Kickboxing. Hey, what's up? And everyone, so today I'm going to feature a new training equipment that's been uh, uh, trending. It's not a new concept, but it's been used by a lot of athletes nowadays. So uh, I'm just happy that I got mine because I improvised and I used a cheaper kind of what others have been using. So what I'm saying is an aqua punching bag or an aqua heavy bag, you call. So this is an improvised mooring boy. It's used for boats against, uh, uh, serves as a bumper at hit, to uh, avoid hitting against docks. So yeah, this is an 18 inch mooring boy. It's a dock edge brand. All right, so I got it off Lowe's for 80 bucks plus shipping around 96. So yeah, it's heavy duty 18 inch mooring boy. Um, instead of an uh, aqua punching bag, that's probably like four times the price of this one. Serves the same purpose. It is actually the same. They just did a little improvisions on the aqua punching bag. But if you come look at it, it's practically the same. So it's very easy DIY. You can do it by yourself. Here, right here, fill it out with water, unscrew the valve with a flat tip screw. Valve will probably be an uh, inch and a half or an inch, I think. So easy to fill it out. Just purchase a garden uh, nozzle, standard garden nozzle. It's a 38 by something. I'm not sure of the specs. I'll show it right here. All right, so don't punch it through with uh, anything hard. Just does the, uh, the valve enough or the nozzle enough would be the nozzle will be long enough to punch it in through and fill it out with water. Just attach it to our garden hose, standard garden hose, fill it out, and then lock it back up with your flat tip. I've seen a YouTuber who drilled it all the way down through, and when he screwed it back on, it was just like spewing out water and leaking. So don't do that. All right. So right here, the attachment I use is a heavy-duty cable with locks right here. All right. Double just to be sure and instead of using an anchor shackle or a bow shackle which I can't find the right fit for this boy right here I just improvise and use a PVC plastic pipe so it's a standard cut as well you can get it off Lowe's I didn't have to cut mine it was a standard cut it was a perfect fit so I just use a mallet hammer punch it right through it avoids less friction with the cable as well as the cable that's why I chose a cable instead of like direct hanging it off a chain link or the carabiner right here. Carabiner won't fit, but like it lessens the friction between this rubber, hard rubber here for the boy. I, uh, and um, just the plastic, between the plastic PVC lessens the friction and make your bag last longer. All right, so yeah, they say it's better than a standard boxing bag. I have a six foot Muay Thai bag as well. It lessens the water, absorbs the impact of the punch, gives you great mobility. You can do your movements, footwork, move around the bag. And yeah, but I think the main purpose of it is the absor absorption of the impact. So the water absorbs the impact instead of like um, going back to your joints. So, yep. All right. And then it's better for uppercuts as well. Instead of like a regular bag where you could just punch straight through with an uppercut none of the upward movements this one you can dig right through under for a good uppercut form right here in the bottom hooks as well gives you that more of like a human uh, body feel when punching the bag all right so yeah more movements more footwork that's good and if you see above the cable there's like an excess cable that i just duct tape here i've seen a good use for it Voila, a swimming noodle, oops, all right. So, swimming noodle, extra cable tie, equals head movements. Oh yeah, all right. So, mobility, head movements, footwork. Got it all in one equipment. I'm so happy about this. The Aqua Standard Bag with the head movements here on your noodle. All right.
Guys, if you've done this or want to try it out, please comment and uh, down below what you think about it. If it's really better than a regular bag or the bag would still serve its purpose. Don't forget, don't overfill it with water. It's going to be a lot heavier. This is easy, around easy 80, I would say 70 to 80 pounds already. And it's softer as well, a little bit uh, lesser impact on your hands and joints. So don't overfill it. See, there's some creases here because I didn't overfill it. So just let the water do its job. All right. All right. So thank you for my video today. Uh, again, comment and subscribe if you haven't did uh, yet. Please, thank you. And uh, this would uh, help me in uh, putting out more videos, helpful videos like this for boxers, athletes, strikers like me. And uh, yeah, see you all soon. Thank you.